Okay guys, welcome back to my channel. This is WV Running Dawn here and today is Sunday which means it is time for my review preview video. So I'm going to review week 15 of my 50 mile, uh, my higher running 50 mile ultra marathon training plan and preview what's coming up for week 16. Now everybody knows what's coming up in week 16. At the end, it is the EHQ 12 hour run. So, uh, as far as week 15, somebody's out getting it up the hill there, okay? This morning, so, or this afternoon, because it, it is after 12 o'clock. So what we have for week 15, what we had was mostly seven to eight mile runs. So I had a uh, seven to nine mile run, which was in, in the middle there. And then uh, had an up-tempo run. And then it was seven to nine miles, seven something. And then I had another run on Thursday. And then rest day on Friday rest day on Friday so that's that was nice to have a rest day on a Friday had, haven't had that for a while on this training plan but it is coming down to the end so my the big deal was my uh, long run so my last long run of the training plan was yesterday I uploaded a video for that you can check it out with the previous uh, video selection after today but uh the uh, the uh, running this week was easy. It was slow, most likely around the uh, 10 mile, 10 to 11 mile range, except for the up tempo. The tempo run was a little bit, uh, a little bit quicker, but um, it was pretty much a an easy week, low miles. I'll tell you how many miles I have after I'm done with this run for my. Uh, Sunday, which will, will conclude the uh, the week 50 mileage. Right now, I think I have about 34 miles. Today is supposed to be four something, so uh, four to six, I think. So uh, once I go up here and come back home, I will give you my weekly, my final miles for this week, which will be probably most likely like around 38 or so. I don't know what the decimal points are, but it'll be around 38 point something miles for the week. But uh, I'm running up to the Sunshine Bridge, turning around in that area, coming back, and then I'll let you know what's in store for week 16, besides the big race, or the big run anyway. Well, it must have rained last night more I don't I didn't know it was going to rain but this uh, area here behind the uh, price cutter rainbow plaza area is much wetter than I thought it was going to be the uh, the water holes have grown but uh, I'm just gonna go to the end of this here and then go back it'll give me a little over four miles if I go back straight to the house but I think I'll cut it short there at the end of the road and walk it in and close out the video so here we go
Okay guys, that's it for my 4.2 mile run. Finished in 48 minutes. It was a slow and short miles on the trail, which is fine with me because it's a taper week. It's week 15, finishes up the week. That will give me about 38 miles for this week. And uh, it's only going to be slow and uh, short for the next week also till race day next weekend. Now I'm looking at my race plan here or my my uh, my training plan. Looks like I have a tempo run for Tuesday on Dexter's birthday. It'll be about six miles and then four to five miles on Wednesday. It's a rest day on Thursday. Maybe a two to three miles on Friday if I want to do that. And then it's race day on Saturday. So that's running for Tuesday, Wednesday, maybe Friday if I want to. It's up to me. I don't know. Maybe we'll see. But that's it for my review preview video. It's been pretty short this week only because there's not much to talk about. Uh, Tuesday is Dexter's birthday. I might do a short run on that day and then do short runs the rest of the week until race day on Saturday. But then um, on Friday, I will be preparing myself for the EHQ 12 hour run. I'll get a cooler. I'll put my drinks in there. I'll get my food. So I have my hydration. I have my nutrition for the for race day. We can use our vehicles as a uh, as an aid station, so we'll be able to do that. Plus, take advantage of the aid station that they'll have at the uh, the five mile loop area. Now, I've told you before, this is a five mile loop race. So every five miles, you can go back to your car. When you get back to the uh, uh, the uh, parking area at the park, the uh, Valley Falls uh, Park there. So I'll be able to do that and uh, I can do my own nutrition or I can take advantage of theirs. They'll have the EHQ uh, nutritional drinks there, the, uh, the powder, the, uh, the, the salt caps. They'll have all that stuff available to us right there. So um, I'll also have that in my, uh, in my Gatorade and in my water that I will have in my cooler. So that's it for today's video, guys. Make sure to like the video. And comment if you want to know more about the EHQ 12 hour run or the 50 mile, the higher running 50 mile ultra marathon training plan. Be sure to share the video and let me know how your training's going. But most of all, guys, come back again so you can see me in the next one.